win loss record only says so much about a team. It's the easiest way to measure them, sure. But something you can't measure is a team's character. Sometimes you need to get kicked to the dirt before you realize what you're really capable of. And that was the case for Wildcat hockey this afternoon. Cooper Black got his first rest day of the season today for Alpina. Early on, Wildcats looked like they'd have the same magic they did last night. Kyle Van Dusen has a wide open wraparound, but he just hits the pipe. That was Alpina's best scoring chance on the day. Dakota goalie Jack Mastronardi looked good early on as well. Van Dusen follows his shot and puts it out for Colby Plowman, but Mastronati beats him to the puck and holds on. James Bolinowski looked comfortable in the net for the Wildcats, though he's calmly able to deal with the Dakota pressure on the power play and help keep this one tied up through one. It all fell apart in the second for Alpina, though. Matt Thompson got a five-minute major for boarding, and Dakota cashed in. Lucas Kochep fires one in that Ryan Bookout deflects in for the Cougar goal and they take a 1-0 lead. Dakota would add two more shortly after, including this upper decker from Alex Berez. By the end of the second, Dakota would go up 4-0 and it's just not looking good for the Wildcats tonight. When it rains, it pours. Zach Pendrick makes it 6-0 with a hot wrister in the third. Alpina's undefeated start comes to an end as they are on the other side of the shutout tonight, 6-0. It's not time to write the Wildcats off just yet. They'll bounce back, and I'm sure they'll never want to take a loss like that again. They get some much-needed rest before they play in the Gaylord Showcase this upcoming Friday.